Above the Clouds A6. Let's talk about Above the Cloud A6. I've seen the A6 revival. I've seen everyone wearing A6. I've seen everybody standing in them. I've seen it. I'm happy for you guys. But I can't do it personally. It's just too normy. It's too basic bitchy. Everyone's wearing them now. They've kind of lost their luster for me. But from time to time, I do see some A6, especially from Kiko. And now from this collaboration with a brand called Above the Clouds. And I'm like, you know what? I might have to put my A6 hate to one side and start giving these guys props because this stuff is starting to look really fucking good. This is courtesy of ModernNotoriety.com and it features a collaboration between Above the Clouds and A6 on a pair of GT 2160s. And they look absolutely delightful. You got this amazing, lovely, scrumptious mix of like burgundy brown with silver hits, a crispy white midsole, an icy clear outer sole that extends into the heel unit. You got these off-white laces and just a nice mix of like mesh and plasticky bits, see-through bits. But in general, the colorway is just gorgeous. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. And I might have to honestly stop hating on ASICs and get a pair because these look fucking fabulous. According to Modern Notoriety, Australia has been killing it with a sneaker collapse. Big shout out to Up There, Earl's Collection and all the brands from down under doing their thing. The next big Aussie sneaker collab comes from Sydney-based sneaker boutique Above the Clouds. Okay, so it's not a brand, it's a store. A sneaker, Sydney-based sneaker boutique called Above the Clouds. Following up their green colorway from 2023, Above the Cloud now adds a reddish chocolate brown hues to the retro running silhouette. The colorway draws inspiration from the changing colors of Japan's maple leaf trees across the season. Like the last pair, this colorway also features a translucent Nextian textile construction. Okay, that's what this is. It's a, what's it called? It's Next Kin. Next Kin translucent construction on the toe box and midfoot, paired with a hexagonal loose knit mesh around the heel and metallic silver overlays. The Above the Cloud A6 GT2160 is expected to drop globally on July 20th on ASICS.com and select retailers. Don't expect Above the Clouds to announce their own launch prior to the global release. Grab a preview below. Look how good these look, man. And again, look at the price. This is why Nike are failing. You see all these reports about Nike's stocks and Nike sales going down. It's because they're not innovating and the brands around them are chipping away, are chipping away. And they're offering customers something different, something better, and usually something cheaper too. 150 for a sneaker collab, limited edition shoe. I'm not mad at it at all. I'm not mad at it for a limited edition sneaker collab. I'm not mad at it at all. $150 is really fucking good, especially in this market, especially in this financial economy we're in at the moment. They look so good. That translucent next skin material thing is absolutely gorgeous. Um, I love that you've got this like faux snake skin material at the toe box with this like chocolatey brown burgundy color. The silver accents mix really well here. The logo looks really good with the with the border of the ready brownie color around it. The ivory, almost off-white laces look really cool. The mesh on the tongue, on the lining, like just gorgeous. And of course, my favorite bit is definitely this kind of icy sole type of thing they've got here on the outer sole. I think it's icy in it, if I'm not mistaken. The instep here looks really nice as well. They look really good because this is also my big test. I'm not sure about you guys, but... When I wear sneakers, one of my big things I like about wearing sneakers is always trying them on, but looking down. I think the looking down test is really not spoken about enough. Like how do they look once you've got them on your feet? And they look really good here. Not too pointy, not too square, not too slim. Just the perfect amount of like point and shit. Nice retro runners. I like how they look at the top. The back bit is really nice too. I like this translucent heel tab here. This is pretty cool. The spots here are nice. The only thing I don't like, there's no branding from the collab. I want to hear, you know, I, sometimes, I don't know about you guys, but sneaker collabs, I want to see the fucking branding. I want to see above the clouds written somewhere. But you don't have anything, not even on the on the insole. No above the cloud branding on the tongues, nothing. On the heel tabs, I don't know if that's a good thing, but I personally would like to see some branding, just so I know it's different. If I do another edit as well, if, if I was making them, the other edit I'd make actually, is I'd make these bits icy. I'd make it an entire icy outsole. You know, to kind of complement this inner bit here. I'd make it icy here. I'd make this completely translucent. All these little grey bits. That would actually make it hit really hard. But they look, look at this picture. Look at that picture. And then you've got this. 
and this is courtesy of my actually my my guy big up my guy um big up my guy over and under over and under actually has this picture that also features that also features a soon to be released a6 new era i'm not mad at it especially you know given what my name is i'm not mad at that hat at all with the A6 logo, that is so hard. There's an A6 logo. There's an A6 New Balance. There's an A6, sorry, New Era collaboration dropping too. I'm sure these are meant to match. So maybe above the clouds will put these out. So this is pretty cool. I'm all for it, man. I fucking love the hat. The hat looks so hard. So due to come out soon, according to Modern Notoriety, they're due to come out on July 20th, allegedly. July 20th. So keep an eye out for them and spy them if that you're that way inclined. Buy them if you're that way inclined if you're not that way inclined i completely understand if you're not that way inclined i completely understand